Hey, it's Dyer. I know who you are. I'm glad you do. I hope everyone out there does. You're recording? Yes, I am. Hi, it's Betty. <laughs> and I hope everyone knows who you are. I hope so. Yeah, you're the reason half people come here. And you're the reason the other half come here. Yes. <laughs> Interesting how that works, doesn't it? Thank you for coming, by the way. Yes, thank you. What are we doing? Eh, we're going to look at a game. Well, that's <laughs> kind of the point. <laughs> yeah, some game. I don't know what. Is it a shooter? No. Good. I won't torture you with another shooter. Thank you. Uh, I could, but I won't. No, thank you. Instead, I'm going to show you this one. Okay. What are we going to see? An explosion. With a crank. Oh, the Great Gatsby. So I guess that's a reproduction of the cover then, huh? Pretty much, yeah. Hmm. So, how could they turn the Great Gatsby into a game? I don't know, but that's probably tough. Well, take a look. It's a bona fide piece of printed matter. Who me? Hey. This fellow's a regular Velasco. It's a triumph, a burst, a realism. Yeah, it's so real. You're to stop too. Didn't cut the pages. Look for Gatsby in the garden. Now, I've never actually read The Great Gatsby. It wasn't required reading. Not in my eyes. How so, they put it on the list of banned books now? Probably. All the good ones from the Well, I've heard a lot of people really talk crap about the book over the years. It's a pretty good movie, I think, from Leonardo and Catherine. I come with the recent one, right? Yeah. And they've done like 15 different versions. Anyway, so here you are. You're playing the character of uh, Nick Carraway. I guess who's the main character of the book? Or the Gatsby? I don't even know. <laughs> it's been a long time. I'm pretty sure Gatsby was the topic of the book. Stuff like this in the book, I must have missed out. <laughs> hey, wait until you see the second boss. Have we gotten to the first boss? No. Actually, I'm not sure if there is a first boss. I don't think there is. Well, how can there be a second if there is no first? So the second would be the first. It's the boss at the second stage, I know that. <laughs> Good job, it. old sport. Down Gatsby. Isn't he great? Yeah, apparently he is. <laughs> so, you get your Ninja Gaiden style cutscenes here. And there's the creepy green light the typo negative talk about. I don't know if that was reference to this book or not. I don't know. <gasps> he disappeared. Valley of Ashes. Alright, time to hop a train. That was preemptive. Usually birds in a video game are just bad. Hmm. What is bird week? I like birds. Uh -huh. birds. Hmm. 
I guess I'm thinking of mainly like Pox and Ninja Guy Dan and whatnot. Games that they are. I keep getting martinis, I think. That's something Nintendo never would have allowed. This looks like it's a very clever game. I like it. It is. It actually is very clever. Ah, uh, here's the boss. Second, first boss. Yes. Why are they playing the Batman theme? I don't know. And you know this. <laughs> Batman. If there was a laser beam firing set of eyes, eyeglasses in the book, I really missed out. <laughs> Is it a wild sex scene? Those are clothes? Yeah, they're shirts. Oh. I don't know who she is, but she's clearly sad about something. Gatsby's leaving her. Oh. New York City. that hat do? Can't you yellow? What can you do now? Uh, that means you have more power. Unfortunately, I can't reach a tennis girl up there. Well, if you go back up the same way you did before. Well, that's just it. I came down. There's no real stairs to get back up. Oh. They put a wall there. Yeah, she says something like, um, going home to Missouri where they never feed you snakes before ripping your heart out and lowering you into hot pits. Okay. This is not my idea of a swell time. Uh, wait, that was uh, Willie Scott in Indiana Jones with the Temple of Doom. Sorry. These guys are boozing up. Alright, obligatory sewer stage. <laughs> with vertical alligators. Yep. Because alligators crawl that way. They shoot straight up out of the water. <laughs> oh, I know what those gators do. Especially in New York City sewer gators. Yeah, didn't you ever see that documentary that uh, aired on TV back in the 80s? Yeah, I did see that as a child. I was terrified. Yeah. Go away, gator. What, what was it, 20? 2020 or something did that? Yeah. People are flushing their pet alligators down the sewer and they're growing to monstrous lengths and eating people. Mm. Pretty sure that never happened. Mm. Well, I'm sure people, you know, flush stuff and they grew, but I don't know but, they doubt there was a gator. Yeah, like an 80 foot long gator with a, with a six foot wide mouth. That probably never happened. Probably that size didn't happen. Oops, don't get that big. Exactly. Alright. I think they tap out at about 16 feet. I was about to yell at you for not jumping off that barrel on the left hand side when I realized that you weren't the barrel. <laughs> well, that's that boss. Whoever's in the road, oh no! I think someone just died. And I think that's Gatsby, and he gets shot. West Egg. What kind of, kind of name is West Egg? I have no idea. But also, there are pirate ghosts in the book? How come I missed this? <laughs> This is a cute game. I, I, I'm enjoying this. I don't understand how I missed a book containing laser beam firing, disembodied eyes, and eyeglasses, and pirate ghosts. I'm 
very disappointed. But was this stuff in the movie? No. no why not? Shut up. Apparently, Nick was Simon Belmont, because the gas remainder just crumbled. Gats <laughs> be believed in the green light. Your gastic future, the year by year, recedes before us. It eluded us then. That's the matter. Tomorrow we will run faster, stretch out our arms farther, and one fine morning... So we beat on boats against the current, borne back ceaselessly into the past. <laughs> you said beat. And cue credit music. That's it? Yes, that's it. Wow. That is a short game. Isn't it, though? Wow. Well, it, now I'm disappointed. Well, the thing about this is it actually started as a Flash game that was a parody of uh, NES games. And somewhere along the way, they were actually able to, able to make it into a real NES game. Sure, they could have expanded it a bit, but as it is, it's just kind of fun to run through. Which also, I believe, makes this the first no death run of uh, done on our channel. Yeah, you didn't die. The end. Congratulations. Thank you for play. Ding. Yeah, I know. And since I didn't die, I should get the little bonus ending screen. Yep. Nick went home. He's had enough of West Eggs and Pirate Ghosts and laser beam firing eyeglasses to last him a lifetime. Now it's time to grow old and die in relative obscurity. Hmm. Huh. And there you have it. The Great Gatsby. For it's NES. the great something. I'm very sad that this is all there is. I know. I'd like to see an expanded version at some point. Yeah. Maybe throw some other stuff in there. It was an obvious joke from the beginning, but the fact they even made it into a playable NES game, though, that was pretty cool. Yeah. And there are also other games adapted from literary works. There's a Jane Austen's 8-Bit Adventures. No, really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Does she fight zombies? I don't think so, but you never know. <laughs> so... You wouldn't get that reference. What, Pride, Prejudice, and Zombies? Mm-hmm. I get the reference. Okay. I never read it, but I get the reference. I think they made a game out of it. Wouldn't surprise me. So, anyway, um, if you have anything you'd like us to play... And... More like this, except longer. Yeah. Well, you know, we try and keep our videos to about 10 to 15 minutes. Yeah, but I fully expect to get, like, a little bit of a dabble, not the whole game. <laughs> well, some games you just can't get a little bit of a dabble in because they're too long to begin with. Or in this case, they're too short. Yes, I will agree there. I would have loved to play more of this. And, as always, go ahead and do all the things we usually ask you to do, if you would. It'd be nice. Like, subscribe, share, yeah. click the little bell icon, whatever, comment. We're actually getting to close to 200 subscribers, considering that yeah. I thought that we'd maybe get 20 if we were lucky originally. That's kind of a milestone. Yeah, we're real close, too. Yeah. So, by all means, share. Definitely share this. Like it. All that good stuff. Subscribe. Yes. So, anyway, this has been Dyer. It's been Betty. Have a fun. Bye.